I'm gonna wake up little Miss Melissa and change her into a candy sweets outfit. How cute she is. I don't want to change her, but this is gonna be equally as cute. Look at her little special lovey. Oh, you're so cute, little Miss. Need a pillow, huh? Let's put your bobby behind your head. That would be much more comfortable. Sorry, kitty. You should know the drill by now. She looks cute. Let me. No, because I have a box over there. Trying to do it from this angle. She looks so different on camera than in person. I don't understand it. Maybe it's just how it looks on the screen. Alright. I'm going to put her in something that's um, just like a onesie. Want to look at everybody? Um, It's pretty hot. So uh, she needs a diaper change because she was taking a nice long nap. And, uh, I have to get one of her bottles ready. And I need a modifier of Hassie's, too, but my E6000 glue is sealed shut. Like, I can't get it open. There's stuff in it, but I can't get it open. So, I don't know. See, that doesn't really match. The, so, we don't really have any pants that match. So, she's just going to try wearing a onesie. Get her big belly. It's all indented right there where her diaper is. <laughs> hmm... I need to get her a plain white onesie to wear under. I don't know where. I know Patricia's wearing one. And I don't know if I have any other ones that are three month size, so. Much easier to dress in silicone. That's really nice, actually. She smells so good that like when you take her clothes off of her, her clothes smell good too. I hope that scent stays with her forever and ever. I'm sure you can always put a new scent wafer in or something. So she can smell like a new baby forever. We'll keep this white onesie on. Your chunky legs. They are so big, look. I can't even fit, like, they're bigger than my wrists. <laughs> okay, so, oops, I gotta do a diaper change, I forgot. Um. So, she's got a candy theme. She loves candy and sweet stuff. And she's wearing a size 2 right now, and it fits pretty good, so this is probably going to be too small. It is just a size 1. It's a good thing I had extra size 2s. I think I might have some in my collection, but, um, I don't know. I might have got rid of them all, because I'm trying, constantly trying to, like, kind of downsize a bit. Just with unnecessary things, but look how cute. <laughs> that fits cute. Size one and honest diapers. She's probably like a size one to two of diapers. Right in between two sizes. I think I'll keep this one on underneath. This might fit a little bit tightly with it under, but... Oh, some people asked why you need a white onesie under. Um, it's to cover up their cloth. And, uh, for, 
If you do it with a real baby, it's to uh, protect like their clothes in case they have a blowout or something. Which, one of the babies that the nursery had last week, not last week, maybe the week before, yeah, her dad came and got her, and she was sleeping in the um, thing, and we didn't even realize that she had had one, and her dad picked her up, and was like, ooh. Kind of glad that her dad had to clean her, because he had to change her whole outfit and everything. <laughs> He's like, where's your mom when you need her? <laughs> Dads usually pass babies off to moms with those kind of messy things, I think. But he was a good dad. Cleaned her all up and put her in a nice, clean outfit. Oh my gosh, it's like tight on you. You're a big girl. Yes, you are. But it fits really cute. I don't want to put this this way. Because you just keep slipping in it. It's got a big lollipop on it. Nice and shiny. Let me see how this goes over your legs. She doesn't really have, she has um, full arms and three fourth legs, but her arms, like, she has a body where it makes her arms kind of more like three fourths a little bit because it has like a joint on the shoulder, but um, she looks really cute. So, And then I can cover up her legs too. See how cute she is. And then I've got her sparkly shoes to go with her. Yay, look at these big legs. Here, like a little bunny. It's hard to buckle. Can't imagine putting these on a real squirmy baby. enough to put on her. My goodness. I gotta get her some skinny jeans. They had some at Old Navy where I was looking at these, but they were so expensive. They were like eight dollars and they were like 35% off, but still, I don't know. I don't like paying a lot for baby. Unless it's really super perfect. Ooh, this, it fits this foot better because her this foot's like more crinkly up. Oh, so cute. <laughs> so cute. Look at you, little precious girl. <laughs> she's kind of fancy, but then she's like not because she's not wearing pants. So she can sit up on her own a little bit. It's getting dark out. I'm losing, <gasps> I'm losing the light. <laughs> you little stinker. When I wasn't watching, huh? I was looking out the window at the light. Yep. So I've got two separate bows. I was thinking I want to see what this big bow looks like on her. Mm -hmm. It's a little big. I mean, like, around her head it's a little big. Got a lot of videos to upload. Everything I do with her, I make a video of. So this video is really long. I don't know how it got so long, but um, there she's just ready for her little afternoon to play and stuff before she has to get to bed.